What up? This is Plus from No Cap Bets here with your free pick in the game between the Phoenix Suns and the Dallas Mavericks, October 19th, 2022. Here on YouTube, we crush the free picks on YouTube every damn day. So make sure you subscribe to the channel. Couldn't believe my eyes when I saw the Mavs as four and a half point underdogs. When Jason Kidd completely out coached Monty Williams and made Phoenix look like a G League team in the Eastern Conference semifinals game seven on their own floor. Now you're gonna hear everybody and their grandparents today talk about, oh, it's revenge, the revenge factor. But please don't buy into this narrative. The Suns aren't even on the same page. No one even wants to be there. Jay Crowder is like, yo, I'm not playing. Like, just trade me. DeAndre Ayton is like, you're not paying me. Like, give me the max or get rid of me. They he even tried to go to Indiana Pacers. Those guys were both integral to their success. Reports all summer about the owner. Um, he races as hell. They find him 10 million and, and suspended him, I think, for a year or something like that. So he's in the KKK. It's just a whole dark cloud over the entire organization. So in come the Dallas Mavericks, fresh off of the beatdown they just gave the Suns. They let go of Jalen Brunson, which was gonna have to happen at some point, but now they got some new weapons. So you're gonna see Dim Witty in the starting lineup, first full season with them, and he's gonna be running the second unit as well, according to Jason Kidd. They have a legit rim protector now in JaVale McGee. They just acquired Christian Wood, who's going to really help out with the... He's basically going to get the green light to score anytime he wants to. Um, might even be the Mavs' second best player, this guy, Christian Wood. Tim Hardaway Jr. is back from injury, and they even added little boy Campazzo from Denver to go chase around point guards like CP3 and all these other guards, you know, 94 feet. Luka is probably the front runner before even playing a game for MVP this season. While everyone was doing podcasts and going to Met Galas and partying, Rick Rubin's part, what, what do they call that dude? Michael Rubin. Luca was in the gym and he wasn't just in the gym. He was playing for Slovenia. He was playing back to back in the Euro Basket League. 12, I'm sorry, and in 12 regular season games against the Sun, Luca's averaging 25.8 points, 7.6 rebounds, six and a half assists. Suns really don't want to be on the same floor together. And for the last two seasons, if you were taking the Suns as a home favorite, you were paying a premium. Me, I like value. So it's the Mavs all day, four and a half for the lock. Subscribe to the channel, join the No Cap Bets Nation, and hit the notification bell. Subscribe to No Cap Bets the podcast and stay all the way tapped in with us. You already know what it is. No lies, no limits, no long talk, and I'm plus. Bless up. Thanks for watching No Cap Bets on YouTube. For winning picks, betting tips, and no long talking in the content, hit the subscribe button and join the No Cap Nation.